Okay, so today we've got another Reaper 2 video. Now, finally, after so long, the amount of months that had to go by, Reaper 2 has decided to drop their newest update. Now, in this update, they decided to drop two new Bankais, one of them being the Bankai for Shinji, which I'm not even going to attempt to say the name because that thing is crazy. But then besides that, they decided to finally add the Bankai for Una. Hana Minazuki. Bankai. Minazuki. So yeah, Minazuki has finally been added and your boy did manage to get it. And so you guys already know how this works. I'm going to do a quick little showcase showing y'all what Minazuki can do. Show y'all the moves and everything like that. And then after that, we'll get into the rank matches. So with all that being said, let's get on to the showcase. Okay. All right, so now that we are here, we can start the showcase. So first things first is to whip out your sword, and we need to go into the Shikai. So in order to do that, you just type in the name Minazuki. And as you can see, the animation for it is a bit bland, I'm not going to lie, but it is only the Shikai. You just raise your sword, and then it gets a green effect. Now, this thing actually has a couple of moves, but the first move we've got is your Z move, this one being Minazuki Rush. So you basically, as you can see, giant freaking hitbox, and you essentially send the monster of the Shikai to the opponent, and that move does guard break, and it does like 50 damage. So really just a free move to launch out for damage or as a combo ender after your right click. The next move we've got is your X move. So if we click X, it's called Dive Bomb. Minazuki basically just belly flops onto the opponent and that in fact stuns them. And it is a pretty long stun. So if you land that, it's basically a combo extender. However, it does have a lot of startup. So the way I think you should use it instead is because it's not really a true combo extender, you should just block and then when they go to guard break you launch the x and as you can see now he got stunned and so i can actually combo him next move we've got is your c move so when we click c it's pretty much you summon minazuki and it actually spits acid which does a crap ton of damage and you can actually true combo that if you decide to do um four and ones into a right click acid spray and it is true now the next thing we actually have is a u move so if you click u on your keyboard you actually hop on minazuki now this thing gets its own m1 so as you can see if i am one him i'm basically like chomping the guy and it's got it it's got a like triple m1 string it's also got a right click so if we right click it actually spits acid like the freaking acid hollows if you guys remember that it's got its own block animation where it blocks with its freaking wing like yeah, this thing is actually really cool they they popped off on this something to note is you can in fact um i think you can at least run or maybe you can't run but you can at least yeah you can flash step with it but you can't jump now this thing also has its own move so if you click z you can actually pretty much do the minazuki rush yourself it's just the same z move except now you you're on it now you lose the dive bomb move so i don't know if you guys can hear this but i'm clicking x as you can see nothing happens but if you click c you actually get the acid spray but i ended up mis aiming it by the way i'm not gonna lie i kind of forgot to also put on visor so the moves that i was just showing y'all do even more damage with visor so like i was saying if you click b you will actually eat the opponent and put them in your mouth and then spit them out. And as you can see, that thing did 200 damage. Now, I don't know if it's blockable or unblockable, but it's pretty good. And if you actually use it in like a 2v2 game mode, you can actually eat your teammate and it'll heal them. So yeah, all in all, I mean, hopping on Minazuki isn't really a bad idea. It does really good damage. However, I will say probably just sticking to your sword is a lot better. But as you can see, 95 damage M1s. Like th this thing hurts, man. And then when you get off of it, you just click U again. So yeah, those are all the moves now we can move on to the bankai so in order to actually bankai you type in chat bankai and as you can see you get that really creepy cool animation that animation is honestly one of the best animations in this whole game bro they perfectly did the cutscene, the music they even freaking got the voice lines in there like this thing is so dope but yeah now we move on to the bankai now this bankai is interesting because of the passive that it has so the passive of this bankai as you can see is mania when you receive damage or deal damage it grants you a slowly rising 
rising buff to your speed, damage, and defense. The buff goes away after 2 seconds of not doing damage or taking damage. And if 2 seconds pass without, you know, taking damage or doing damage, you actually get a debuff of 10% to your speed and how much damage you take. So yeah, the passive all in all is actually pretty good. It essentially forces you to want to combo the opponent as much as you can. As you can see, essentially what ends up happening is your damage pretty much just ramps up from you either dealing damage or taking damage. And when you haven't done enough damage like in time, so real quick, as you can see now my M1s are doing 45 damage, whereas before they were only doing 43, I think it was. Now I'm going to wait two seconds. And as you guys can see, that red circle right there means that now I'm actually slower and I take more damage. So as you can see he's doing five that's because the buff actually ran out but now if he hits me again yes yeah, six so as you can see yeah the 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 passive is both a good and a bad thing if you're good at comboing people and really just sticking to people then it won't really affect you and it'll actually be a good thing but if you're not good at that then yeah you'll be taking more damage but now that we've done all that we can actually get onto the move so the first move we've got is your z move so if we click z you get bloodstream basically two slashes and something i also forgot to mention because i'm dumb as you guys see whenever you hit somebody with a skill they get that red effect on them that is called blood clot and what happens is after i think four or five seconds seconds of them being hit by a skill it will actually explode and do like almost 100 damage so yeah just to show you guys that it did that again click z they take that damage and then look after a few seconds 95 damage that it's insane and that actually works for all the moves however it does not work on the charged moves and that i will get on to in a bit so as i just said all your moves can in fact be charged which just takes more um riasu and it takes longer to do but if we hold z you get a different version of it as you can see, you actually do more damage with the slashes and you do a third one instead of just two. The next move we've got is your X, which is pretty much an AoE slash attack, which th that move is freaking crazy because remember that also inflicts blood clot. Now you can also charge this move, but personally, I don't really like the charge version as much. However, if you decide to charge it, as you can see, you basically do a shorter version of the barrage and then just do a really long slash. I personally though, just actually like the big barrage, not to mention it also gives the blood clot the last move we have is your c which if you click it it's pretty much just a dash and 240 damage by the way with blood clot so that's easily 300 damage and then if you decide to charge the c you basically get the same thing except now you get two slashes which by the way each do like almost 200 damage just remember though on the charged versions of the move you do not get the blood clot passive so you're basically just getting the raw damage and so that is just something to remember but yeah those are basically all the moves now we can move on to the b move which is the final and last move so if we click b as you can see you get the move blood drops which basically makes like a freaking domain expansion from jujutsu kaisen and what this does is it makes it so all your moves are automatically charged as you use them so as you can see now i have all the charged versions of my attacks and it's pretty much just a convenient way of getting all your charged attacks without having to just sit there for 10 years actually charging the move however as you guys saw it does crack and run out after about like 10 seconds but yeah all in all this thing is absolutely insane insane broken all the moves you can basically just use as combo extenders slash combo enders like you can't really ever miss them and so because of that they're just like you just can't hate on these things and they do so much damage you've got your passive and the freaking blood clot is so stupid man for instance if you just do a right click into the z there's no counterplay to that and by the way he takes the blood clot damage and yeah he got chunked if you want to use your c move there's no counterplay to this 240 with blood clot like a it, this thing is crazy man see i'm really happy that this thing finally came out i'm really excited to use this i think this thing is going to be insanely broken sorry for the long showcase but there was just a lot to cover but yeah with all that being said let's get on to the rank matches all right so we got the first match now i'm not gonna lie guys i have not played pvp in pretty much like around two months however i did just do a warm-up match to basically just remember how to actually play the game and the muscle memory did definitely kind of kick in a decent amount i'm gonna go for the x here that way yeah he gets stunned that's my combo now perfect reason as to why i like the uh, x move on minazuki so much something else i want to note is it is actually the next day since i've decided to do the intro to this video so if i sound a bit different than that is why but as you guys can see bro this dude literally <laughs> 
<laughs> he just got chunked, man. Um, I do have my X on me, so I can see if he decides to flash step. Okay, he's not gonna flash step. Bop, take that combo for myself. Minazuki body slam, which by the way is for some own unholy reason a guard break. I haven't even bonkai'd by the way. He is just losing all of this HP without me even bonkaiing. Like, this is what I'm talking about. This is just the Shikai, bro. This thing is absolutely insane. I'm gonna use the Z there. That's just free damage, so no reason not to use it. Also, I did not know that the X is actually a guard break. So the fact that your Z and X both guard break is actually kind of crazy. X on myself. There's the stuff. Oh, no. That would have worked so perfectly, but I ended up stunning him and he stunned me. So, I mean, not much I can actually do about that. All right, so we hopped on the Minazuki. Launch the Z on him. That's free damage. I want him to try and come and hit me so that I can. <laughs> there we go. I'm on him. Get him with the E. All right. The sad news is he's got Hiero. So, yeah, that only does 72 damage. Bro, why are you running, man? I'm just a giant freaking monster. Oh, my God. I missed. All right. I'm going to hop off. He obviously does not want no smoke with that. Yeah, I woke up like freaking two hours ago or something and then decided to hop on to finish let me dodge that please 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 and he hit me of course but i decided to go back on the minazuki i'm not even gonna lie by the way i keep fat fingering the damn minazuki button so part of the reason why i keep hopping on this thing is because of that this thing does take a crap ton of uh stamina though so i need to try to really just conserve this hit him with the bite again there we go it's a free 72 damage i mean you can't really be upset i still haven't gotten to the point where i actually need to bonk oh my god it's unblockable thank goodness this thing fl uh, flings though bro i've got the freaking there we go i hit the stun but he was mid animation sabaku catch him lacking thank you very much we're gonna be able to do a lot of damage with this combo here bop 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 into the body slam Wait, but oh crap, the body slam was on freaking cooldown. Oh, bro, I didn't know that the body slam was on cooldown, man. I'm gonna just match the Z move and see if maybe if he ever leaves an opening. No! Okay, that's bad. I think I'm gonna have to Bankai. I'm not gonna lie. I did not think that I'd have to Bankai, but I guess I will be going for the Bankai. I'll live this. And yeah, now we're gonna Bankai. I'm not risking anything, baby. This looks so trippy. All right, see, now that we Bankai, this, this dude lost. They like realistically there is no universe sabaku here and yep he's dead there is no universe where this dude ends up winning this fight now bop then i can knock back into the z move that's gonna hit him with blood clot which is going to absolutely chunk him 50 damage pick him up on the ragdoll into the sea and that is death yeah oh my god man this thing is so crazy on to the next one all right so we got the next match and it looks like we're against a vasto lorde here which is actually pretty different as you guys can see from that first match though man this bro minazuki is insane i'm not even gonna lie myself thought that um the uh, shikai itself wasn't even gonna be good but it is actually like extremely crazy i right, hit him with the bisect now what i'm gonna do is knock him back into the acid spit that thing does so much damage man what oh my god i did not think he'd counter me right there all right if he decides to come and combo me we can unload the x onto him that's a free stun however yep all right so that would have worked but he ended up stunning me D what the hell i was not expecting that. all right hit him with the high end oh bro i keep clicking the damn i keep clicking you instead of um freaking y and it keeps giving me no dodge that no dodge it I, i'm not dodging that bro i'm a ginormous monster man like what do you expect from me on the buy side though i think i might be able to land the eat attack onto him okay hit him with the acid spray All right, i'm just gonna get off of this man the minazuki thing isn't that bad when you um like can land the bite but if you can't land the bite move you are not doing much buddy all right, bro. I, all right, no, oh, because I'm lit. I literally just keep clicking you. Oh my lord, man. What the hell? Oh, he freaking short charged it. I was not expecting that. Bob, we can eat him right here. No, he used his um freaking vanish on that. All right, let me get off of this thing, please, bro. I I really need to stop fat fingering you. That, that's all I'm asking for. Bob, 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 into that. I will say this dude has not flash escaped once. I don't really know why, but I mean I'll take it. It is literally just free damage um land the ladder here no i messed it up it's not that bad we can still land that but i did end up messing up the ladder i told y'all man i'm a bit rusty if he comes towards me is he just gonna let me charge okay um land the body slam that is a free combo can't do anything about that no bro. i keep doing it and then he ends up no 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 
that hitbox will always be insane to me. I keep landing the dive bomb exactly how it's supposed to work. The problem is this dude ends up using a move to stun me as I do it. All right, it doesn't matter though, man. I'm in the freaking, I'm finally in the Bankai. So this dude is basically cooked now. Bro, for real thought he was gonna land a counter on me. That is not how that works. Into the X here. That's going to hit him with Blood Clot. He can't do anything about that. Flash escape that. And yeah, this is where the combo game really just starts, man. He is about to lose so much HP that it's actually, like, not even funny, dog. So bop, bop, bop. Hit him with that ladder right there. And now what I can do, knock him back into the C. That's going to do 107 damage, by the way. And I'm going to pop the Blood Domain. This is going to iframe his uh, move right there. And now all my moves are enhanced. So now what you do is you kind of just mash everything since, like I said before, everything is just enhanced now. Bop, land the X here. That's just going to do a crap ton of damage. Okay, good counter by him. I'm going to, I'm mashing the C, but I forgot. The C is like the only move in the Bankai that actually, oh my, I'm so dumb. The C is like the only move in the Bankai that actually um, has like a OD long cooldown, which I guess makes sense since it does so much damage. But all right, buddy, I don't even know why you're trying, man. Like you are not, you're not going to win this, man. I'm just being honest here. Hit him with that high end, dodge that, bop. What is that? There's no way that that actually hit me. Bop, block that, and he's dead. Yep, he's not living this. Um, yeah, the X kills here, so see you in the afterlife, buddy. I'm telling you, man, Minazuki, once you Bankai, it's over. GG's. All right, next match. I just want to say, by the way, um, sorry for the sloppy gameplay that has been happening. I literally, like I said before, man, I am a bit rusty, so if I'm playing more sloppy, sloppy than I normally should, then that is why. We're against a Quincy here who's actually using a Greatsword. I don't really remember, um, what the Greatsword is, uh, actually good for. I, if I remember correctly, I think it just has OD range. All right, here's what I'm going to try. I'm going to try Kick Barrage into the X, and that will... I, I missed the X. Okay, well, that would have worked under normal circumstances, but I ended up missing. Is he going to block? Yep, free guard break. Thank you very much. There's... You, you literally can't even react to the Z, by the way. It just comes out, and there's, like, no animation. Bro, this dude is getting absolutely tossed. I actually feel bad. Like, th this is one reason why I think Minazuki is just so broken. The damn... Um, oh, my God. I flashed that by accident. I don't, I'm not even remembering where my keys are, dog. The damn Shikai itself is just so stupid compared to the Bankai. Like, the Bankai is even better, but the Shikai itself is just even more insane. I'm gonna go for the X here. That's a stun. Nothing you can do about that. Is this dude running? Buddy, where are you going? You haven't even dented my health bar. Nah, that's not how this works, man. When you start fighting, you're <laughs> finishing this fight. Am I just gonna... I think I'm just gonna beat him with the Shikai itself, honestly. You, nah, you know what? I'll, I'll give him the justice. I'll give him the justice. I'll Bankai for him. Alright, so it looks like this dude also decided to use his Volt Standing. He has, um... Bombay. So this could be a bit trouble. Bombay does a lot of damage. No, 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 no. I'm not getting hit by that, bro. Bombay does a lot of damage. So this could be a bit scary, but shouldn't be too problem. We ended up getting a splash escape. This is where all my damage is now going to come from. Charge the C here. Oh, it's blockable. Damn, I didn't know that. Okay, see, I thought you could use bisect and then charge the C because when you charge the C, bro, your damage is just absolutely insane. So now I'm going to wait for it to explode. I'm going to follow him. And this is what I'm like, bro, knock him back into the Z. That might pop another blood clot. No, it was on cooldown. All right, that's fine too. Damn it, I flash escape by accident. I, I, I don't know what is wrong with me today. I kind of just keep fat fingering all my keys, but it's all right. We're still going to end up winning this. This dude is trying so hard to run and escape, but you do not get to escape this Bankai, man. The only way you escape is if I let you escape, buddy. Also, I think he might be dead right here yep he's dead oh my god it does so much damage dog on to the next one all right so this is probably going to be the last match raw sabaku man my favorite kind of people and man let me just say i have been absolutely loving that's a sabaku yep and i'm pretty sure we caught his flash escape i have been absolutely loving this damn bankai man this, like the shikai and the bankai alone are just so strong that this is probably gonna shoot up to my number one i'm not even gonna lie it is so good man block that if he tries to combo me 
Okay, well, that also works. You should be an end lag from that. Yep, because whenever you... No! But, but... No, 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 no. Okay, I'm going to drop the X on me. That's a stun. I'll be taking that combo now, buddy. Never mind, because he decided to triple strike me. The thingy to um take people's combos does definitely work. I've just been messing it up, bro. I keep using it whenever people are going to end up stunning me. And so it doesn't end up working how it should. But it's still fine. We're definitely... I mean, as you guys can see, this dude's HP is just disappearing. This is what I'm talking about, man. Like, the Shikai just being... Being as good as it is definitely adds to how even more broken the damn Bankai is. So there's his flash escape. I'm actually pretty confident that I could kill this dude in one. Is he going to charge towards me? If so, dive bomb him. Yep, that's my combo now. Thank you very much. I'm not even going to lie, by the way. I'm so confident that I could finish this dude off right here. Like, Sabaku. Yeah, he's dead. So, you know what? Because of that, this will kill him. I'm going to do another game since that one was just really short. GG to that guy. All right, so this is going to be the last match since the other match ended so quickly because the dude was a Soul Reaper, and we all know Soul Reapers take way too much damage. What the hell was that? Oh, I think that was the uh, new move is what it was. The thing besides Bisect that you can get. Like I was saying, those Soul Reapers take a crap ton of damage. So this Shikai slash Bankai against a Soul Reaper is just absolutely going to chunk people, including this dude who also happens to be a Soul Reaper. So as you guys can see, this dude's HP is pretty much about to get obliterated. So knock him back, Sabaku. Now we can, all right, I was going to hit him with a ladder, but he ended up subbing it, hit him with the acid spray. That thing does way too much damage. I will say, though, sometimes, as you guys also saw right there, it tends to, um, wow, that was not supposed to happen. Sometimes the move tends to, into the X right here, take that combo for myself. Thank you very much. I, yo, the freaking belly flop from Minazuki is just way too strong, man. Knock him back, Sabaku. And this dude's also going to die. Because this is going to be the last one, though, I am going to let this dude Bankai instead. But this is what I'm talking about. Whenever you go against Soul Reapers, man, they're the ones who pretty much die the fastest. Bop, bop, into Whirlwind. All right, this dude's going to have to Bankai eventually, right? All right, there we go. He, he did end up bankai and That's good. I'm not going to lie. Um, The Zanka no Tachi Bankai is very sh You know, I'm going to I'm gonna go on my freaking Minazuki here. I haven't done this in a hot minute. I'm kind of just getting... This is the main reason why I don't like it. You're kind of just a ginormous hitbox. Not to mention um, the movement for it is like really weird compared to... Oh, I can eat him right here. No, I missed. How did I miss that? The movement for it is really weird because since you're so big, big you kind of have to like control minazuki um really weirdly i'm gonna see if i can hit this dude with a triple strike i was gonna say i'm gonna see if i can hit him with a drive by sabaku but he kind of ended up just giving me the combo so hit him with a ladder right there bop bop knock him back into the acid spray that absolutely chunks him i think they end up actually running out of how far the damage is though which does suck but it's whatever all right here's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna bait him let him hit me and then just drop the mina oh god wait aren't these blockable i'm pretty sure these are blockable now all right drop the minazuki dive bomb on myself there we go no man all right um the dive bomb was supposed to stun him but he ended up using a move that has armor so it doesn't matter though this dude basically lost now there is no once i've transformed man there is no possible comeback i'm just gonna iframe that way he can't hit me with like any of the moves that he's using wait you can just run out of the domain what the hell i did not know you could do that bro you can literally just run out of the domain what is th <laughs> okay that's actually kind of goofy bro as soon as i domain sabaka here oh damn i thought he was gonna try and um thingy i think i just got countered as soon as i put up the domain the dude just instantly started flash stepping backwards which is kind of funny i'm gonna land the c here 168 damage man with the blood clot bro you cannot make this stuff up into the egg did this dude just give up he's not even fighting back anymore honestly i wouldn't be surprised bop bop and he's dead he said i love that you take no stun it, just unlucky man ggs though but yeah as you guys can see man minazuki is absolutely busted it might just be the strongest bankai in the game like I, I think i'm outright just gonna say it i think it is man it does way too much damage all your moves are pretty much free like you never need to think about actually using them you can just land m1s and then boom you can pretty much land all of your attacks and then even the shikai itself is so broken like if only the bankai was good then okay i would have said like all right you know it might not be number one but bro the shikai having pretty much an un like you can't even tell when you're gonna get hit by the z which is a guard break the x is a guard break it's a free get out of jail free card and then the c is just free damage off of a knockback like you really just can't make it up man and then no, let me not even get started on the bankai bro like i said all the moves are free you don't need to think to use them you could just use them in combos and the 
still work and the damage is just absolutely insane so yeah hopefully you guys are lucky enough to get it yourselves and before anyone asks my next video on the game is going to be on the Sakanade Bankai so don't worry about that and before I actually end the video I just want you guys to know that your boy does have a discord so if you want to join that go ahead and do so link should be down in the description thank you guys for all the support recently it really does mean a lot to me you guys are great and I really don't take any of that for granted man so I just wanted to say thank you but yeah with all that being said I hope you guys enjoyed the video I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll see you on the next one peace